Okay, Sly, this one's pretty simple. Tail Grizz until you can get the code to his fortress. We need to get in there if we're going to stop him. You shouldn't have any trouble finding him since he's tagged with the homing darts. Just follow the signal. We probably didn't even need the darts. He's kind of hard to miss. Okay, he's on the move, Sly. Stay close so I can pull the data we need off his phone. And don't underestimate him. He's no lightweight. It ain't your biz, my name is the Grizz. You see, I'm hairy and scary and all of that stuff. Get the heck out of my way, oh, I'm gonna get rough. Work. <laughs> trying to run some kind of game on the Grizz? I'm tired of you telling me to walk the line straight when you're walking it all crooked. Yeah, that's right. Uh-uh, uh-uh, no, no, no. That ain't the deal we had. Nuh-uh, no. I got you the cane that that big old hairy dude made. Now you need to hook me up. Hook me up, yeah. Ho hold on, hold up. I'm losing signal. Hold on, I said I'm losing signal. I said, I hold on. I can't, hold on. You catch that, Bentley? Yeah, sounds like he's talking to La Paradox, and there's trouble. Don't lose him. Don't need no canvas. I just paint on that because I'm better than y'all. <clears throat> running out here, but I need to keep my paint production going, so I need you to find me the resources. What? I don't know. Uh, chickens, turkeys, ostriches, parrot, frog. How would I know? Just make it happen, man. What? Oh, uh, man, hold on. I, I gotta find some reception. I gotta find some... Hold on. Man. No. Oh, hold on. Bentley. Why don't we have a phone like that to talk to Dimitri? You really want Dimitri calling you? Good point. Forget I asked. Sorry, what's that? Oh, come on now. I scratched your stinky, stripy little back. Now you scratch mine. Not only that, I got those other crazy Cooper folks messing with my business now. So I gotta deal with that, and I don't see you giving me any help. No help. No. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I'll, I'll take care of it. Huh? Oh, oh hold on. It, it's the reception, man. I can't hear you. No. You can hear me, I can't hear you. You chop it. You chop it. You chop it. I can Forget it, man. I, I can That's why I can deal with my paradox isn't going so well. Oh, poor guy. I feel so sorry for him. Yeah, I'm crying over here. Just stay close. I'm still trying to access his phone data. Shrimp is that he stinks. 
I'm flowing so bad it ain't fair. The Grizz will teach me paradox. Don't mess with the bear. I'm finding this all pretty interesting. So hold on a second, please. Don't give me that. We had a deal since day one, and I did my part. I did my part. I, I need those eggs, and I need them yesterday. Don't leave me hanging, because I will come find you. Oh, oh, you think I'm scared of you? Only thing scary about you is this. So hold on. Don't give me that. We had a deal since day one, and I did my part. I did my part. I, I need those eggs, and I need them yesterday. Don't leave me hanging, because I will come find you. Oh, oh, you think I'm scared of you? Only thing scary about you is the smell. Yeah, hello? Hello? Stupid phone. I'm finding this all pretty entertaining. Yeah, give them an advantage if Chris is off his game. <laughs> Now let me tell you how it is. I am an artist. I got paintings to create. And I ain't putting up with any more of your excuses. Now, you give me the eggs I need for my paint, or I climb through this phone and squeeze them out of you myself. You got that player? Hello? Hello? Why you did that? Dang! I guess that means you didn't get the code? It does. Looks like we're back to square one. I guess the bear got away, huh? Carmelita, it's good to see you. Uh-huh. I'm only talking to you because I have some information for Bentley. I've been telling my own, and I have the security codes and full schematics for his mountain base. Wow. Thanks. You're welcome. So you'll get it to Bentley for me? Of course. I'm headed back to the hideout now, but wouldn't you rather hand it to him yourself? Maybe I should. After all, you're not exactly trustworthy, are you? Ouch. So, we're good, right? Don't push your luck, Ringtail. I caught up with the ringtail to give him the intel I'd gathered on Grizz. Half of me still wanted to slap the smirk off his face, but the other half wanted to talk. Working on my own these past few days had given me time to think, and I things. Sly may have been lying to me the whole time in Paris, but I'd lied to myself as well. In my heart, I knew something was up, but I didn't want to admit it. I wanted to believe he'd changed, that maybe I'd changed him. But Sly was who he was, and I had to accept that. 
Although this crazy time-traveling business had given me a new perspective on that, too. In the past, I'd always chase Sly, arriving on the scene after the fact. But now that I'd fought alongside him, with Bentley, Murray, and his ancestors, I had to admit a newfound respect. We aren't really so different. We both fight for justice. We just do it from opposite sides of the law. The question is, can I live with that? Honestly, I don't know. But for now, perhaps it's enough that I see things more clearly, and that we have a common enemy in Le Paradox. Because I am not going anywhere until I put that stinking weasel behind bars!